Hey guys, thanks for coming back. Uh, this is uh, Mark Schilling. This is Jeremy Beasley. And hey. We're back with another student interview. So Jeremy just got done going through our CO2 training. It was a whole week long. Jeremy, what'd you think? I thought it was great. It was a really good course. Uh, I've done the fiber before. This is doing the CO2. It was a totally different format and uh, it really uh, it was a good step-by-step -step process on how to use a pretty cool machine. What brought you back? Like, I, and I know you came through Fiber was what two years ago? Uh, yeah, 2019 or nine, nine. So almost, like, right, almost 18, three years 19, ago. Yeah. yeah, three or four years ago. So, like, what what brought you back? Why are you back getting a sales CO2? Well, so I started with the Fiber Laser, uh, did the training with that, and it became pretty clear that my engraving business needed to expand because the products that my customers wanted, I wasn't able to provide them all. Now Fiverr was the great place for me to start because it covered all the things I really wanted to do going out the gate. But the more I got into it, the more I realized I wanted to expand my abilities and the CO2 was the logical path forward on that. And if I'm gonna do a CO2, I wanna go with a company that I've used before that I trust, right. which is you guys. Oh, that's awesome. And I know people people get real confused because like, I deal with that in the phone call. It's like. Um, oh, I want a fiber, I want a fiber, and then can it do cutting boards? And they just don't understand there's two, right. it's, it's two completely different technologies, right? Like, and so fiber does, you know, metal and, and some polymers and plastics, yep. and then the CO2 does like, basically everything else. And, right? and each are, I mean, there's a whole industry you can do with the fiber, and there's a whole industry you can do with the CO2. I just, I happen to be in a position where I want to be able to cover as much ground for my engraving as possible. And you've had your, your fiber for almost three years or whatever. Absolutely, yeah. Um, what, what, do you, what, what would you say is like your most exciting thing about that? Um, like owning it and, and what, are, what are the cool things you've been able to do? Where are you at with your business on that, you know? So uh, there were so many things. So originally I got into it because I wanted to work on firearms. And uh, once I got the laser and got it unpacked and got it set up in the shop, I, I just started experimenting on a bunch of stuff. And it didn't take long for me to find out that uh, number one, there's a demand for almost anything you can engrave. <laughs> right. And so I did a test on a Zippo lighter, and I have been doing primarily Zippos for the last, uh, I'd say nearly three years now. That's actually been uh, the, a large portion of my business. And um, I gotta say, I didn't expect it to be as fun as it is, but trying new things. Um, one of the things I like to do with a fiber laser especially is I really like to cut deep into the metal. I like to get really deep engravings, and I like to do a lot of scroll work. So if I can make it look a little bit more antique and I can give it some scroll work and even try to make even, I try to go and capture the hand engraved look as well. And it's yeah. tricky, I, it's, it's, a, uh, it's still a process I'm perfecting, but I'm getting closer and I really enjoy it. So. That's cool, that's so awesome. And, and a lot, it's hard for people to understand like something like you know, what you're talking about is being successful with your, with your business and, and your laser and ROI. Those are tricky things to explain on the phone, but right. I'm glad you're here and I'm glad you're back, man. And uh, I know we've had a good time this week. I oh, had a great class time. And, you know, it's hard to explain to people what happens here. It's, it is kind of like right. the cool club and it's magical. And it, it really is. <laughs> and, and if someone's watching this, I got to tell you, um, I cannot stress enough. Number one, the, the material you get, the equipment you get is great. The training you get is next level and it gets you set up in a position to start your business right away. And that's been the advantage with sales training from the get-go. Right. I work with other engravers out in the industry that have been struggling for three, four years to turn a profit or learn their equipment. And I was able to do it right after my five days of training. And then I was actually able to pay off my fiber laser in just over two months. Yeah. With Zippos. Awesome. Like, this is what I'm talking about. Like, there is a demand and they get you in a position to do that. Now, coming in with the CO2 as well, same situation. I know going forward, I'm already primed to be successful going out. But really what I like to tell people about, when I tell people about sale, I tell them about what happens afterwards. And that is uh, the social groups that you're a part of because there's, there's always gonna be a time when you find you need to learn something more. And if you don't have a reliable source for it, you're YouTubing it, looking online, and you're trial and error. But once you finish your training with these guys, you actually get plugged into their private networks so you can talk with experienced engravers, you can talk with all the people here on the staff, and they can troubleshoot or they can help you come up with new ideas. It's, it's a very strong community with a lot of experience. And uh, yeah, it's just that right there is actually your main, uh, I think your main source, what, what is going to propel you above and beyond what other engravers are doing right now. Right. I really appreciate that, Jeremy. Like, yeah, we, we do look at everybody here like a family and, 
And we are. We're, your success is our success. And, and we really, really feel that from the top to the bottom. Like we all, you know, we all are on that, on that same page. So I man, I feel like thanks, we're family, man. Yeah. Thanks for doing this interview, man. Hey, I man. Appreciate I appreciate it. it. And, I, and if you're watching this out there and you're, you're on the fence, man, we do these interviews for you guys just so that, you know, it's. I'm not telling him what to say, so that you can understand coming straight from somebody's mouth. This is one of our our repeat clients. I mean, just so you can understand like what we do here and, and why you should choose us. So, but thanks for thanks for tuning in, guys, and uh, we'll see you next time. Yeah. You don't give them a pause to, to find a cut point, right? You just no, start rocking yeah, out of your right. chair. Oh, let's go.